My name is Timothy Chase. I'm the Union Training Committee Chairman for Kalita Air and ALPA CKS-140. If you fail your initial check ride or any validation or evaluation event within the training curriculum, you will be given additional training uh, to correct the deficient area and then be given a retest on the deficient items and then proceed forward from there. You'll also be placed into the special tracking program, um, which at Clit Air we call OPT, Optimized Proficiency Training. The OPT, or Optimized Proficiency Training Program, is designed to give crew members additional training that have a deficiency in some area of uh, the training curriculum. So in addition to the six month uh, online computer-based training that you'll do on the iPad at the six month and then at the 12 month point, you will also come into the simulator at the six month point and do an additional recurrent event at that time. And then you'll do your normal one year recurrent event. If both of those are good, the OPT program is just a one year footprint and you're done, and you just go back to the normal one-year uh, simulator schedule. So the contract has a provision for uh, personality conflicts during training environments. Uh, you reach out to the director of flight standards in writing to request a change in the partner or the instructor as appropriate, either in the sim or on the line. Uh, I would advise that you start that chain at the lowest level. So we have fleet standards captains for each fleet, and then we have a manager of flight standards and a director of flight standards. Work your way up until you find someone, if they're unavailable or out flying or what case may be. If none of those people are available, for whatever reason, chief pilot is your direct supervisor. You can reach out to them or the union to help get the ball rolling. The short answer is no. Um, the training curriculum, our AQP, is FAA certified and driven by the company and the FAA to to give us an approved training program. Yes, recently they added an extra simulator to the new hire uh, qualification footprint. Um, in addition to that, we have brought on some new hires from other airlines that had 747, 777 training experience and they're working within the training department to create new PowerPoints and standardization on some of our briefing slides for each of the lessons. Your standing bid form is in your Comply 365 app on the iPad. So on the home page from there, you'll click on the Forms tab and then scroll until you see Standing Bid Form. There's four choices. You should rank them in priority order. 7-4 Captain, 7-4 FO, 7 Captain, 7 FO, whatever you want to fly. Uh, we don't have a domicile location on the standing bid form that you may have seen on previous airlines. And there is an additional tab to select if you're interested in joining the training department. Yes, we have rest and duty limitations during training that are different from our normal line flying. Reference the training section of the contract for the most recent information. It's currently 10 hours of duty and 14 hours of rest. Plus, you are still required to have one day off in every seven consecutive days, similar to a one in seven when you're flying the line. I would tell an initial trainee that you need to work together with your fellow new hires, form a team, work together you're with your crew members there. You'll progress faster as a group uh, than you will by yourselves. Help each other study and, and progress through the program. Also, don't be afraid to ask for help. The training department will always respond positively to someone who says, I need a little extra help on this. All of the instructors are great about that. Training management gets you scheduled for an extra sim lesson if you really need it. And we want to get you through the program successfully um, and efficiently. And then 
We, were, we want you here. Remember that. There's no reason to expect management to respond negatively when you are either falling behind or need extra lessons or anything like that. We want you here, we want you through the program, and we want to get you out on the line and fly in with the rest of us. Ah. No, disregard those snaps. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. All right. Um, Sorry. <laughs> yeah, stop laughing. <laughs> um, this is serious.